Marines back to watch more Demon Slayer. We're here to watch episode 21, Against Corpse Rule. We got off another... Last episode was fucking hype. It was hype dope shit. as shit. Uh, a lot of lore went through. I had, I had a blast watching it. Or what about you guys? We are. I thought the last episode was good. I liked We're... 19 a little bit better. Man, you crazy. I know it. We're all, we all have our own opinions. It was a great episode. I really, I'm really intrigued by the butterfly girl. I hope we get to see more of her story and yeah, stuff. I, they said her name. Yeah. yeah they said yeah. her name, but I didn't catch it, unfortunately, because I wasn't trying to... And now during, like, subs, I try and take as many notes so I can read more, and now I missed her name. Well, <laughs> they'll say it again. They always say a person's Just name like more than once. Normie. That means that we all don't know her name. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it was Brittany. It's, it's butterfly girl. Butterfly, it's butterfly girl. girl. Um, but, yeah... Really excited to see more of her. I really want to see more of her. This is really good. Um, hope Tandro's okay. Man, he look like he's fucked be, up. You know, he gets fucked up after every single demon fight. He'll he'll bounce back. He's got to yeah, go to one really of them uh, wisteria houses and uh, heal up. Yep. I really thought that was dope that that she couldn't uh, last episode that she just, that poison was what she did. Like, that's yeah. awesome. I'm, I don't. My other thing, Chris. You know how you're talking about why don't you go kill the rest of them off? My other yeah, why don't you is, poison them why off? Why why didn't she get the poison to give it out to the rest of the fam, bro? Shit, the little younger soldiers could probably use that shit. What, what's going on with that? Because it's probably finite and really hard to make. And it's made out okay. of the wisteria trees and are everywhere. No, there you go, know. Chris. She <laughs> said, uh, she out, said that only well, her and her swordsmith know how to oh, do it no. in that little ending preview thing we watched. Yeah, yeah well, that's shit. Like everybody needs to know how to no, do no, no. that. She said it's a secret between her and her swordsman. She puts it inside, like, it's inside of her, like, sheath or whatever, yes. the, the poison. I, I could agree like, that that should be standard practice, because even if you slash at a demon, like, that's all you would need, really. Yeah, yeah, for real, that's where I'm gonna, gonna go with on that yeah, one. Yeah, that but. should Boys that should out here getting her clothes melted for no reason. Yep, 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 anime, hey, man. Anime it's rules, we'll figure it out, guys. Anime. There's probably anime. a reason behind it. Anime. There's some politics. Right, There's ready? politicking in the core. Well, Are you guys ready for this shit? Veiled yep. clocks? Yeah, but Veiled I was confused as to whether or not this was a market substitute or not. It is oh. not, guys. It's not a market substitute. For the actual Demon Slayer show, please support the OG content on Hulu, VRV. Just just support you UFO and what all they do. If you want to support us, check out our Patreon. It helps endeavors like the gaming channel. We've done a lot of cool things on there. We're streaming a lot during the quarantine times. It's keeping things going, guys. Thank you all for that. And uh, if you can't help us with the Patreon, you guys can comment, like, or subscribe. There's a bell right there for notifications. Comment, man. Comment away. Tell us how you guys felt when you guys watched this episode. And all the international viewers out there, please subscribe. Oof, what you see that you guys watch and you guys don't subscribe. It's, it's, it's not cool. Oof, what uh, uh, but yeah, let's get the show on the road. Right. Get the Oh, that's real. That's real. Young real for demon. Oh, uh, it has to be. Oh, it is. How does this hair look like a they spider really still? They really harping on the story, actually. I'm so stoked hey, to Hey, man, this they're really touching on Rui's story a little bit, aren't they? I thought his hair looked like a spider because he was a demon, not because I, that was his... I thought he was dead now, yeah, yeah, so I why do I give a fuck? I refuse to feel bad for him. I don't care That's what, what I was talking here. about. I refuse to feel no, bad for him. I'm really... Oh, come on! I'm, I'm super stoked to see what his humanity is. Yeah, man, they're probably showing his story for a reason. Yeah. Everything happens for a reason. Going around, saving kids? Huh? Huh? Jackson? Hey huh? man, that's fucked up. That's, that's ignorant. <laughs> that's ignorant. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Damn. Look at the what the shit so realistic. Nanto you oyano I call the shinda sonoya nigo to new oyano yakume atashita nase ka ore no oyo ore no oyo ore wo korosou to shita aha wa naku bakari de korosare sou na ore wo kabatte mo kurenai. He's a demon, bro. The dad died and stuff. Man, yeah, obviously, bro. Something wrong with this boy. Damn. Damn. 
無残さは俺を励ましてくださった全てはお前を受け入れなかった親が悪いんだ自分のしてしまったことに耐えられなくてたとえ自分の悪いことだ That's a real image of a night sky Holy shit Hey man look at them trees There it is <laughs> Don't you feel bad now, nope. Mickey? <laughs> what do you mean? How? I mean, who gives a shit? He's a demon. You guys are heartless. <laughs> I'm a demon racist. You guys are heartless. You see how he came to him like a Zabuza? Came to young Haku? I feel you, Serge. I feel you. I guess, I don't know, this has just been very rinse and repeat for this show, like, kill a demon, find out its backstory, I guess I'm just like, I don't know, I'm getting desensitized to it. And I still think his actions as a demon were pretty inexcusable. When he tried to make a family and rip know, people's faces off, he even hurt his own demons. this sibling connection right there in his last dying breath? He was trying to kill them. He, he even said last episode, he was like, I'll kill them, no matter what. He just went up to them just now for in, as an endearing thing. If you were paying, if you were I was, but he also, mm, I don't know. I, I just don't feel bad for him. Scores. Yeah, probably. That's so sad. Yeah, it's gonna It's the bond he wanted. Oh. I got this bond. I know, man. This is dope. He's so little. Damn, yeah, man, he was just a little boy, man. He's he, so he, tiny. he was just a little boy that he just didn't know, man. Shit sucks. I feel bad. Hey, it's you from before. Of course, you is gonna be like, you no. look like less of a little bitch. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Fucking Mickey. You is Mickey. Tanjiro! Hero. I love this song. You just recognized him, bro. Butterfly girl. Ah! What? Oh, she was trying to kill. Dude, she's so, so cool on her song. This is so sick too, man. She's hype. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> what is Evil Demon? I don't know. Her sword? I don't know. I think it's her Evil Demon. Demon what? Play, uh, Demon I just asked that. I just asked that too. Maybe that's what the I word think it was her sword. said on her sword. Yeah. <laughs> Is his hair gonna grow back? Damn, Stop taking care of that. That man's look like Nav sure. from Hunter x Hunter. Oh, me too, man. The next one! The next one! Kakushi? Come on. <laughs> Wrap things up quickly. <laughs> It's like they're the demon star hospital. Where's Inosuke? Corps. Like the medical corps. I don't know. Inosuke. This music is. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> what? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that dubstep was a little, little boom. This <laughs> 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 yeah. Music is so good, though. God damn. <laughs> Bro, no, man. <laughs> she reminds me of Snowflake <laughs> from Ages of Shit. Yeah. Damn. 
You don't care. Yeah, that's an animation. I don't know, man. Oh, like you next level. Oh, you saw the chest. Oh. Gaman, 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 gaman. Whoa. Who the fuck was that? Who the fuck was that? Who the fuck was that? Who the you're not fighting? Bro, this soundtrack doing shit is so sick. more terrifying than the demons. Fight me. No, no, no. You're absolutely right. She's scary. And those giant eyes are terrifying. Yeah, I agree with them. She's pretty scary. Who's the other one? Yeah. What other one? Who's the other one? Yep, there's the other one. one. The other one. There's another butterfly she girl. Might. Maybe she's a moth. Uh oh. Damn. They're all so cool. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, God. Oh. Well, he's dead. <laughs> he just got his shit knocked. Is that oh my butterfly God, let's go against another butterfly girl. What? Butterfly lass? <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> what the fuck? That's really cute. She made a time. Yeah. Dude, that's, that's really adorable, actually. I can see this being in the game. Is anyone else laughing at this? This is hilarious. Yeah, this is uh, great. It kind of reminds me of South Park. I don't know why. Are you trying to kill the baby? Tomi Yoka-san? It's talk, man. You that talk no jutsu. <laughs> She's so annoying. You speak. Dude. Say something. Why is she always so happy? I like her. <laughs> <laughs> She's great. You're telling a story, goddammit. Fucking listen. <laughs> Damn. That's some shit I would say. Sorry, I'm so sorry. <laughs> no! Damn, she would've got him. Uh-oh. We're going to headquarters, baby. All right, here we go. Look at her sitting there like a little tight. Yeah. Aw, that's so cute. Okay, this is good, dude. This Post Broken jaw, Rana. I literally was about to say something. God, God I feel for him. Inosuke! Inosuke! What a tease. Look at that. Have you seen a face before? Oh, Don't no. think that, bro. In this case, arc starts anew. It starts. It's so good to see the squad. Look how cute he is. <laughs> yeah, she oh, is. Yeah. Man, she advanced. So there's one more dude from Final Selection that we haven't seen yet. Yeah, the guy with the big scar. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, there's a girl. Oh. <laughs> It's a new dawn, it's a new day. Let's go, better be in that box, bro. This was a pretty stressful night. I mean, it was, that was rough. They fought yeah. a lot of demons. I, I know, that was a span of a bunch of episodes. This shit was great. If I was Tundra, I wouldn't start fights until right before daybreak. <laughs> I like the guy with the beads. Bro, you see that guy holding his oh, hand? Yeah. I like the guy holding his hand with like beads. I like all of them, and the guy that looks like a Pokemon they, or like a uh, what? Eve advanced. One. They really, they really like made yeah. them look very cool. What was the guy uh, with like the fire hair? Flint like the design. Yeah. 
The design was phenomenal. Oh, this is great. I'm just, this it is makes great. sense that like if there's someone walking around with a demon that's like semi-conscious or not attacking humans, that they should probably notify the, the Hashiras who are like the highest order. But it's cool to, to yeah. see them yeah. all drawn and shit and conceptualized. I'm, I'm glad they didn't kill them off and they were like, yo, meet up with us instead. Let's talk this shit out. Like... Yeah, so, oh my god, okay, so episode, okay, first thing I want to say is, like, the music and animation in this episode was phenomenal. I really enjoyed it, like, the water <sighs> and like, the moon and everything they were doing. That was so <clears> good. <throat> and then, like, we got to see Ryu, Ru- Ru- I can't say his name. Rui. Rui's human, like, backstory and, like, how Muzan went after him and stuff. Um, to make his, like, body stronger, I guess. And, like, how he wanted to, like... And he craved, like, that bond, and he broke it with his parents and everything. So, like, don't you feel bad now? Uh, no, not really. No, nah, not really. Uh, he wanted uh, a bond, I, he's uh, never. Wait, 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 wait. Hey, let's watch this part. Yeah, the bond I'm, was I'm never usually, severed. like, not swayed. I'm usually not swayed by, like, bad guys' backstories. Like, I just think it's always, like, a cry tale. Right. But this one was compelling. Yeah. This one this one really spoke to me. <laughs> Her name is Kocho. Kocho. <laughs> that sounds good. That was really good. That was good. <laughs> They're so funny together. I have to end up dating. Kocho, I, I Kocho is her name. Okay, so I thought anyway, this was a cool was episode. A, yeah. It was a hey, so little look. chill for me. Um, alright, so big complaint here. Oh, I like no. Demon Slayer. I like it. I think that the animation is beautiful. We say it every episode, but it's getting a little formulaic for me. I, yes. I hope this next beginning is going to be something a little different than before. It's dope, but there I'm just was, saying this that was like. Yes. way different. We got Gyu yeah. coming, no, and like okay, we got no, no, like. Her, here's, yeah. how, here's how it's Muzan, becoming, Muzan came uh, to no, the no, guy. No. Yeah. Oh, hold on, hold on. Here's, like, there's like conflicting we're, we're ideologies no, with Gyu. Let, let, let me say something. It, it, it's okay. getting formulaic in, this, in the sense of find a demon. Fight the demon. Yep. Get get your ass kicked to near death. But it's called the, but, demon right, slayer. No, let, me finish. Called- let me finish. And then at the end, use a breathing technique that one we haven't learned about yet, or two, use one we know about in a very different way. Best the demon. You're letting you're it, letting Dustin influence you. Okay. It, it, can I, I, can I, as the demon can is, I, as the demon is dying, find out about its sad backstory and then feel conflicted about whether you should feel bad or not. That's it's, every fucking battle. It's that's it, it, it's it is getting it is very rinse and repeat. It is very rinse and repeat. Can I see my rebuttal? Can I can I see my rebuttal? First of all, this is 20 episodes long. All right, it's like a couple of seasons in it. We're supposed to figure out the backstory. We're supposed to realize that hey, demons are like it, they're supposed to like treasure that in a little because obviously there's an opposition in the demon core where hey. Demons do not have a soul or anything like that. You kill all demons. Now we have a guy out of the blue that joins the Demon Slayer Court who is good to fucking heart and is actually able to see past, like, the idea that demons are bad. And, yes, it took three stories to figure that out because, guess what? This is the beginning of a series, and you're going to see that shit. Like, Each and every single one of these stories, yeah, it's kind of saying rinse and repeat, but it's literally making us go, okay, hey, let's think about it for a second. For example, Rui right here. We, thought, we sat there and thought Rui was a very terrible person for what he did to all those people and all the demons. But, really, we never thought to think, hey, Rui was a fucking child. Rui was, like, a five-year-old or a four-year-old that got sick and that got Fuck. hit hit with some kind of cancer. He didn't know wrong from right, bro. All he knew was his fucking parents. And then out of the blue, Muzan comes out of the way and gets his ass and goes, hey, join me. It's these little subtleties, these little stories that make the story whole at the end of the day. So yeah, you did need those three stories. You did need to know what I'm happened not, to I'm not the guy that or, died I'm like not, so easily because you wouldn't know. I'm not saying you did. I know, I get or, you're saying it's pretty, I'm not saying you whatever. did or didn't, and I'm not saying the show is bad. It's entertaining. I'm enjoying it. The story's opening up. We're getting a lot more characters. It's definitely interesting, but my problem is I'm getting desensitized to all these like sob stories because it's just like it's it's been I know we're at the beginning of the series and that's why I hope that the series can and break away from its formula and keep it fresh but you can't argue that it's not getting formula can I also can I also put an argument and say that we've like watched this in the span of like eight, like I say eight months 
or six months and we probably would have if we would have sat this by ourselves and watched it in like a couple of days it would have been a different hard hitting feeling too maybe I don't know, but I mean, I, it could have been feel, even more in Mickey's favor if we did that yeah I feel like I, I feel uh, like it's def- I mean, I'm, I'm not yeah, I feel it's like good. the it's, show it's good, is bringing up these conflicting ideologies with Gyu and Tanjiro now because yeah like Nahid said the Demon Slayer Corps has never thought to look at demons in a humanizing way and it's kind of reflects back to like how do we view serial killers in real life how do we view like what we consider as demons in real life, child pedophiles, are they supposed to die and with gruesome death? Are we not supposed to try to understand why they became that way or what they once were? Because most people who abuse and abuse others were victims of abuse themselves. I know that's just way off. I'm just trying to come up with an analogy for a real world. But I feel like this was different because we got to see Muzan come and kind of take advantage of the situation. And it was different from all the other demons we've seen. I think the through line here is it's, try, it's trying to make you show that like the most unspeakable evil still has like a cornerstone event that causes it to be that way. It causes them to be that way. I mean, they're not always, you know, they're they're all they're all victims essentially. Yeah, well. you know, I, 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 I totally get that. Um, I, Mickey I'm just, I'm said just gonna be a to lot this. already, so I'm not going to defend my position. I will just get properly dumped on in the comments. Because I feel like we'll just end up running around in circles. Anyway, though, uh, it, it, it is a little the, formulaic. It's definitely a little formulaic. I can't. I can't argue with that. <laughs> it just. It I'm feels say, like the story. It feels like the story only moves forward after in. the demon fights, and the demon fights take up like four episodes each. I'm not but saying that that's key. a bad thing, but I'm saying like I want. I am interested in the story, and I want it to like, you know, chug forward. But we only get like. We get like four episodes of a fight, and then we get like the story moves forward by like a couple episodes, and then it's back to. That's all. Look, it's hey, no, I'm interested in, a, in seeing I this mean, whole like Demon Slayer core and how they're going to get Attack implemented. You guys Attack on Titan, and in season one of Attack on Titan, there was like a string of eight episodes would be one battle, and no story would move forward. It would just be fighting Titans. And, and I'm like, just like, maybe also I just like the fighting in Titans in, like, better or something. We had to like literally, like we had to literally see these characters like, like. Like be friends. There was like three episodes in the show where it wasn't like that, where it was just people just like hanging out and them going with Siri that you guys had issues with also. But like we needed those episodes yeah. to like make sure to like like Inosuke and to like like yeah, I, didn't next to, I didn't mind those episodes, and, yeah. And like we need we need all those things. Like I mean I'm just I just feel like I know that it's a little bit formulaic, but all those formulaic things it, it was very very necessary for us to get to a point where we go okay. There is a big difference of how these people feel about these demons, and Tanjiro is completely different from the rest of everybody else. I just feel like now when we go see these Hashiras, they're gonna be like, why is this kid different than everybody else? We're gonna actually see a lot more of like the inner workings of the government. Like, we're getting like the bigger boys coming in to like talk to Tanjiro, best best way put. Um, One thing that I really like is how kind of like the sense of empathy here is illustrated through Tanjiro's smell. Because, like, I, like, even in real life, people have, like, different levels or, like, how they can, like, sense people, like, other people's, like, uh, pain. Um, different people feel, feel those things differently. And for, uh, and for them to, like, in this series, to show it through, like, someone's smell is yeah. interesting. Um, and I think that um, it, it is defini- definitely, like, valuable for people to talk about that. Gio. Yeah, Gio. Um, I think that he's learning from Tanjiro already, um, and I think that like Tanjiro will have a big influence on the core and how they, like, they they have to slay demons regardless. But maybe yeah. will, there will be less like hate and more understanding. Mm-hmm. And or like maybe special <coughs> circumstances for some. I don't know. No, I think Surge. that like they they one rule has always been once a demon kills another human they have to die. So <coughs> that's Sur- why Nesco's still alive because she hasn't killed it. Uh, okay, okay, there we go. If if a hey, demon Sur- can be found before they've killed anybody, then maybe yeah. that's that's the only exception. So and Serge, I do think you're right about the comparison to Attack on Titan with all the fighting. But one of the things that drives me through watching Attack on Titan is that the story had a huge mystery behind it. Mm-hmm. And you really want to keep watching to find out what's going on with that mystery. And like, I've just, I'm big on story. And Demon Slayer is great with action, great with art direction and shit. But I haven't gotten much of a story yet. Like, I don't know what the actual story is. And That's we're on fair. episode 20. And I just want more of that because it seems like it's interesting. That's what's carrying me through. What if Nezuko does um, end up killing a human, but it's like a bad human? No. She's a dictator. Like they fly her over a castle and just drop no, her from the it, air. Isn't that <laughs> <a case? laughs> 
She'll get that taste, and that's the only reason why she can sleep and stuff right now. Oh, um, uh, I liked how the bond, he was always trying to find a true bond that couldn't be severed, but in the end, his doesn't. parents followed him to hell, so that was yeah. a bond that was not severed. That was pretty cool. Yeah. I was really, uh, that was really sad, man. You guys are hitting all the notes. Great. Um, whatchamacallit? It was good to see that little girl, man. The little girl that made it out the mountain with them. She ended up mm-hmm. being like the second person. Oh yeah, yeah. Who? yeah. yeah like I, 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 I caught she on to when she was like Girls Apprentice. when like Gyu, Junior. Yeah, when Gyu and them were like up top fighting, she was like, "Oh, you're forgetting the other one." I was like, "What the fuck?" And then like when you see her, I didn't notice it at first, but it was her. And I'm just now I have to think that she's like Do you- far more advanced than T- Tanjiro because I don't know, man. I feel like she just got like a bunch of tutelage underneath uh, uh, Kocho, the butterfly lady. Yeah. Do you yeah. think that's her daughter? Because they, they both have butterfly themes. Dude, it could. Maybe I, you're yo. like sister, maybe? Sister? Nah, she looked pretty younger to the older one. You can uh, be someone's younger sister. What do you want? Oh, okay. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I, I, I don't know. I just, I, I thought daughter first. Yeah. Um, I want to say one more thing. Um, mm-hmm. The, um, uh, God damn it. I s- fucking, s- I forgot it. Just gone. Pat is suspiciously talk- quiet. Pat, how do you feel? <laughs> I, like... I don't know. It's the same thing as the last episode. Oh, uh, we've seen. The, I, I want to see new people. Uh, we didn't see the boar head uh, or anything we like that. We saw new people. Oh, what? what? What new people did we see? Like the same spider we, people we, we saw. The same spider people. And we like saw the last three Kojo. Spi- we saw the new butterfly junior. Okay, the butterfly, saw was, the new the butterfly lady was in the last episode too. No, we no, met, not, not, the, met, not the little one. Okay, the little the, one. And then, and then, then we met. All right, so here's the thing. Like, I'm with everyone else saying it's not formulated. I'm, I agree with them. Since the first few episodes to now, I, I that I don't know. Like, the excitement's not there. I don't. I just. I maybe Death Note ruined it for me. I don't know. Um, I feel you, bro. It's it's you know, it's um, each his own opinion. But like, bro, this episode was hilarious to me. I love the part where like Tanjiro tells him to go to run. And like the girl just hits him in the head and runs after her, and she turns into, like a little mini. That shit was hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> so I was wondering why is Tanjiro in so much trouble for carrying a demon around? I understand it's against the rules, but mm-hmm. he was recruited by an old man who is part of the core, right? Yeah. So that <laughs> man should have at least like warned him that yeah, more it's info. like yeah. end quote <laughs> illegal. Like how is why is he in so much trouble now? Like going to <laughs> court or something. I, I think he's Iroko known Daki all said, I think he did. Iroko Daki said it was for failure, bro. <laughs> nah, man. I'm pretty huh? sure he made him aware. Like, I mean, that should just go without saying. It's like, okay, we're gonna keep this demon alive, but I mean, it's not a good luck. You know, like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that that, that uh, part feel, confuses me. That I, I feel like that's one of those things that just kind of goes without saying. I, I, yeah. I, I think I think he's been aware of the risk the whole time. I mean, like he, he, there's been several attempts made on Nezuko's life, so I, I, I don't I don't think that's anything that he wasn't aware of. I'm sure I'm sure he knew. Lastly, there was some. Yeah, but new th- today was the first time that he was considering leaving the core because he cannot be part of the Demon Slayer core and have Nezuko. That's true. That's true. Yeah. Uh, mm. th- that's true. I guess he's never, he hasn't encountered Fuck. more demons since Gyu that have been like trying to kill Nezuko. So, I don't know. I'm really uh, excited for the next couple episodes to see what the Shira are about. Yeah, but I'm also confused crew. because what about the Wisteria houses? Weren't those peop- those two people were... De- well, no, they weren't demons at the Wisteria house, right? When they fought the volleyball girl and the guy... No, no, those two people were demons. No idea. So, yeah, that, so, so, they, so shouldn't the core know about those people like Ex- so there are uh-huh. some demons that do do good unto others and shit yeah, well know. that's what i think i think i think i think this is when all these worlds are gonna come like, finally you know collide get we're together collide. collide when worlds uh, collide one last uh, man 5000 what's good I everybody because you guys actually hit like every single note of mine but i want to say that like tandro the way he talked about demon being helpless creatures to geo i felt that I was like, they, I mean, they're all kind of helpless in a way. Like, no, nobody wants to be a demon. Good you know guy, I mean? Tanjiro. Good guy, Tanjiro. Uh, so you want to be a demon? Goddammit, <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh, Pat! Why, Tanjiro? <laughs> and then, like, and then I felt bad. I got, I felt bad that the boar. I forgot his name. God damn it! I was no gonna skate. say that. Felt you go. You say it. I wanted to say that. 
their new thing in this episode, another thing that was set in stone, all you guys saying is formulaic, was new character arc set in stone for both Zenetsu and Inosuke. Because Zenetsu is going to find out that he I'm, actually did some baller ass shit because all those black shirted people were like, oh man, this guy's really skin, oh, so he's going to find out. And Inosuke, 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 is going to be uh, 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 sad because he got defeated and it'll kick him off on a new character arc, so it'll be different. Yay, I'm done. I, I'm not saying that they don't open up new character arcs and stuff. When I say formulaic, it's specifically to how like we have dealt with like demons. It's just, it's just like the formulaicness is is in the overall like the whole. Demon. I know. I'm just uh, the, the new new things in this episode. Yeah, yeah. I'm not saying there weren't new things. I'm, I'm, I'm still interested in the show. I'm still intrigued in the show. I can't but... take the Steam Buscemi avatar seriously when you're talking to me. It's terrifying. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, why? Why does he have four eyes? Because it just—it's—it's it's it's an illusion. <laughs> he looks like a demon. It's an illusion. Well, all right. Well, guys, anyway, a, those were the things. Those were the things. Dustin loves this show. Everybody in Discord, ask Dustin how he feels about these. <laughs> <story. laughs> Bye. All right, y'all. All right. Bye. 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 Thanks for watching Demon Slayer with the Normies. Check us out on Patreon for early access and uncut content. Special shout out to our super patrons, Eleanor, Jesse, Joe, Lauren, Luis, Michael, Mike, Nick, Ruby, Dangerous, Nuptub, Quentin, Abdullah, Allison, Tristan, Diet Dan, Edward, Keyboard Junkie, the NYR fan, and ZJP. And we'll see you all next time.